Hey guys, Logan, we're up to Season 4, Episode 1 of One Tree Hill. If you'd like to get these videos up to 20 weeks before YouTube gets them, you can do so down in the description, simplereactions.com or patreon.com slash simplereactions. You can get these videos up to 20 weeks early. You can also get them 10 weeks four weeks, one week, and get a bunch of other stuff as well. All the shows that are happening on this channel, you can find them over on SimpleReactions.com, besides the ones that happened a long time ago. Here we go. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. They can't kill him. Plot armor. Plot armor. I'm not faced. Y'all can trick me all you want. I'm not faced. Not happening. Hospital. My name is Lucas Scott. Lucas. Hi, yeah, I, I, I'm a senior at Tree Hill High School. Senior in high school. I'm not sure if your husband's still alive. Then I'd say your world is a lot like Haley's. Today was supposed to be the best day of her life. Is there anything I can say to keep you? No, I'm sorry, there's not. How about I'm pregnant? I'm pregnant. I don't believe you. Hm. I don't either. Hold up. She's a psycho. I love you. Ah. I am not. I mean, I can swim, but like. I don't know how I could do anything to help in this situation. I'm not the best swimmer. I can swim. But, like, that's just so difficult to... And I would definitely try. Running out of air! Great for pregnant women. That's not Nathan. He wasn't wearing black. Come on, girl. Put two and two together. He wasn't wearing his jacket. I can't find him. What do you mean? He's down there. <laughs> what do you mean? Nathan! He can't hear you. He can't, he's underwater. He can't hear you. Damn it! I don't wanna be anything other than what I've been trying to be lately. Oh, Nathan! 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 Oh! Hey, we go look. Is she just sitting there in the water? Damn. Things that take 14 He's a hero. Minutes. In those 14 minutes, three lives hung in the balance. For the rest of us, there was nothing to do but wait. Damn. She can be I charged for that. Call it the waiting room. I don't know Since what it's called. Dan. Reckless. Well, but she was Dan's driving. got as many things. Attempted murder. You could probably get attempted Damn, murder on that. Hill. Someone would have to know to write that on his wall. Whose test did you find at the reception? Was it Brooks? I'm not sure yet. You don't even know if that- I'm your mother, Lucas, and considering that I was pregnant at 17, I just want to know if history is repeating itself with my son and his girlfriend. <laughs> speak again for the rest of our lives, that'll be fine. Oh, oh that's, mm, mm, that's a little weird. I don't know why sometimes people just have such a hard time just keeping their mouths shut. Like, I don't get it. Like, why do you have to tell people things? They're not here for that, though. In trouble. 
There's no way this secret lasts it's not, it's all of this season. I mean, it might last all the season, but like past the season, there's no way. Sorry to bother you, Mayor, but your son's had an accident. <laughs> Rich You know how badly hurt your son is. Just in case Brooke decided to show up, I don't want to be standing too close to you. But look, if you need something, dog, call me. Wait, it didn't seem like it was still that bad. Focus. They literally had a conversation, like everything was fine. Not to make out with her, please. Y'all really gotta hey, stop so hugging. Like I get it. She's my girlfriend. Stop! You gotta stop hugging. At least for now, she is. Y'all keep <laughs> so stupid. Like how I like y your girlfriend doesn't like it. You're having problems with that. Sorry. Just don't, well, it's not that hard. No, I'm not hugging. <laughs> Sid never let Brooke Davis's skanky ass through the gates. And your ass wouldn't fit. I told him I was pregnant. But I lied. <laughs> I knew it. Pregnant. I knew it. I just wanted to. Look, the test wasn't. I'm not pregnant, okay? Ha! Knew it. Ha! <laughs> Look at me go. <laughs> After talk about your confession, have we asked you? You tried to kill me with English. I can't hear you. <laughs> Son of a bitch. No. Damn. Oh, that'd be neat. I'm sure many people who were watching this were like, God, I hate him, or God, he's evil, or blah, 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 but like, how would you react if someone tried to kill you? <laughs> Yeah, I don't like the guy, but I'm not gonna crucify him for that. I mean, that. I was gonna surprise you when we got back. It's a London Bridge. <laughs> like, I'd be pissed off if someone tried to kill me. It's for like, to get those hospital bills, especially Whoa! we don't have insurance. What? I didn't see that. That's cool. That's not as bad as um, ah. <laughs> I have my theory, but for your sake, you better hope he wakes up and tells me that I'm wrong. I mean, look, I know it's a long shot, but you never know. They might actually make a run in the postseason, and somebody might actually get to see me play. Not asking for no special treatment mm -hmm. or nothing, just a chance. I hear you, man. I was there. I'll talk to what? Bang. What are you looking for? Oh. That's Nathan. Oh, no, really? This is my best man's wife. Cooper would be better off if he died in his sleep every time an immature punk comes to tell my son ends up in the hospital. The freaking nerve that you have. Killing, killing her if fiance she if we go to and coffee sometime. What? I'm giving up coffee through my pregnancy. A movie then? No. You're giving up movies too. No, I just don't want to go with you. You killed just a... the father of her child. I'm sorry, no comment. Really? Hardest days seem to last the longest. Everything's gonna be okay. Ah oh, man. Today, for the first time in a long time.
You're a hero. You did everything that you could. He died? Well. Wow. Oh. oh. There's still a chance, okay? Why is she still... What is she doing? Girl! I should have waited by now. How is he? The best chance <laughs> Cooper has is when he wakes up, like... He's devastated, Rachel. Tell it's all him your fault. everything. Hey, I saw you in the limo with Cooper. You were arguing with him, weren't you? It is not a good thing if he wakes up and sees you standing there, or sitting there. Hey, Ma. It's not. But you and C is not that far away. Yes. And I'll be fine. Everyone's separating for college. How are we gonna do this? Part of him's coming back to us. Yeah, and that baby is your... He did a good job with you. Your cousin and your brother. <laughs> wow. The family tree is okay, shaking. Okay, so finish your published. I brought you some makeup and those scissors you wanted. Dang, Brooke, you look amazing. It didn't change, Brooke. I mean, truly change. Woo! The hair well, is I on to point. Yes, but honestly, I don't really think people can change. The voice is always on point. Oh my god. You know, at the end of the day, you are who you are, and it's probably <sighs> always been. Her voice is the most attractive voice I think I have ever heard. With who you've been is pretty horrible. Okay, uh, the runway found. The veils. What is happening? You two. Still. Are you trying to lose your girlfriend? Good, Helen. Devil. Come on. Good. Man. Are you dumb? I just hung out. Um, the other day we hit out in the library and I got shot in the leg. Brooke Davis could yeah. break my heart and I'd you apologize. Think about that much? Brooke Davis yeah. could hit me with the car, and I would still I love her. Day back for your mom and Keith. Brooke Davis could tell me to jump Keith off the Brooke. Grand Canyon, and I would. Apparently, his name is Derek. You call him. I don't know. Derek. I mean, it's not just about me. Derek, I'm what? I'd like to consider too. Like I said, we were I'd, just. I'd like to talk to my boyfriend alone. Like I'm hanging on to the two of us for you. She's breaking Not up for them. Me. I love you, Lucas. Is she not I breaking up with always will. Oh. But we go days without having a meaningful conversation. Oh, really? And I used to miss you so much when that happened. But it never seemed like you missed me. He's not putting in the effort, honestly. You, you should find someone better. Yes, because of it, I stopped missing you. I'm sorry. Wow! You know what? I'm kind of down. That wasn't it. Dude, I like, honestly. If, if you don't treat her like a queen she is... Going somewhere? You shouldn't be with her. I didn't think you wanted to see me. If you don't treat her like she is the queen of your life, it's good to something else. I mean, then we're what fighting. are you doing? And I grab the wheel. You're failing. You face all the mistakes you've made. You'll never change. What? People don't change, mouth. But they can. People. They just don't because it's easy. People to don't change. Bullshit. We're waiting for our lives to begin, like. Figuring will be someone else. Someday. I'm sick of people saying that but after phrase. This accident, people change losing Jimmy easily Keith, all the time. They either just don't know it. All we have is now, Rachel. Don't run from me. Or they just don't care. Like, you're telling me you're the same person you were two years ago? Bull. I don't care if it's no. drastic change or minimal Love change. Feeling. Any change is change. In high school. People don't change. Oddly Bullshit. Yes. When I do, I'll get back to you. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> Accurate. I have a best friend. 
At least I used to. No, she's still there. She's the one constant. You need to get help. Don't hide from it. Get some help. It's made of stone. What are they teasing? They're teasing. Are they teasing Brooke? They're making it look like it's Brooke. Someone or something will find you. Make it all okay. Well, I guess it's okay for y'all to hang all out now. Help sometimes. Someone to help it's us. It's gonna happen. I know it. Now's their time. Remind us that it won't always be this way. It's love, it's love. Oh, is that the creep? And that someone will find you. That storyline kind of went like poof for a season. Now it's back. Cool, lovely. Love creepy people. They they just really you know they 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 really thrill me. Can't you tell? I have had a lot of experiences with creepy people. Um, not full-on stalking, but borderline stalking. Um, people not leaving me alone when told to. So, you know, I know a lot about that stuff. Um, and I wish it upon nobody. And I don't see how someone could do that to somebody. So, it's weird. It's very weird and, and creepy, you know? I've, I've had people from YouTube. People from YouTube, you know, viewers, message me. And, um, it's strange. You know, and it's not just, like, just met regular messages. It's, like, it's creepy messages, weird messages. Like, why are you saying this to me? Like, and then I've had an individual a long time ago, uh, a female, um, like, watch me. Like, every second of every day you know it was really weird um and at some point she got my phone number and called my house you know like and i didn't want anything to do with her you know it's like leave me alone like no <laughs> um she would stare me down in the lunchroom she would you know there were these doors and these, these doors and in school and there was like a, a window like that big on the door and it was like a rectangle window and it was like right in the middle it didn't go all the way down it was it was it was literally like this was the bottom and that was the top like it was like that big um, and I remember so vividly because the weird legitimate creepy shit like this some reason just sticks in your brain for so damn long it's borderline scarring um and i re you know you ever get that feeling someone's watching you you know and you always it you always seem like you know where to look when you get that feeling like you just look up like and i i looked out that window and from across the hall in another classroom 
was that individual sitting there looking at me. It's the creepiest thing ever. You know? You need to let it be known that those per those people, you know, like, don't stay away from me. Don't talk to me. Like, and if it gets, you know, to the point where you have told them that they, they're bothering you, that you do not appreciate what they're doing, you know, that they're invading your privacy and that you've told them once, maybe twice, um, three times is pushing it. That's almost like the, if I have to tell you again, or even if you have to tell them more than twice, um, like seriously, leave me alone, then you need to call somebody. Um, cause I mean, get a restraining order, you know, get something like tell somebody, um, you can't just get a restraining order just to get one because you don't like someone. Like you have to, you have to show evidence that that person is a threat, a big problem, stalking, something like that. Like you have to show that, and um, borderline sometimes you have to show that you've told them to leave you alone. Um, so I feel for everybody out there who goes through shit like that. Um, I could never, like, ugh, ugh, never. I, I don't see how people could do that. Um, like, I, I'm all for, like, I, I, I care a lot about people in my life, all that stuff, but, like, there's a line, you know? If someone tells me that, like, leave me alone, or that was a little creepy or something, like, I'm like, okay, like, that, I don't, I don't screw with that. Like, if someone thinks that I'm doing something creepy or if something, someone thinks that I'm doing something that's, like, overstepping the line or, like, if I'm too emotional, caring too much about you or whatever, like, and you think it's weird or overstepping the boundaries, like, I'm like, okay, like, that's not my intention. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll back up. Like, that's, like, it's that simple for me. Like, I, that's... I have zero intentions to ever be creepy to someone because, like, I know every single experience, uh, nearly every single experience. I haven't experienced uh, full-on stalking, like, like um, following me places other than other than school and like my my own home. But like, that's it, it, that's what Rachel's doing. Like, Rachel is creepy as hell. She's creeping me out to the point where, like, I'm like. I don't like you like as a character anymore like <laughs> you're really creeping me out um and then we're bringing back this other creep from the end of season two uh who is watching Peyton on the webcam thing I don't even know why she does that webcam shit I don't I don't even know what it is like you just sit there on a webcam for anybody to watch you like, that's strange. Like, what do you get out of that? It's just like a live stream, right? You're live streaming anonymously or under a fake name or a, or a, or a, like, what, what? I don't fully understand what she's doing. Camming? Isn't that something else? <laughs> like, I, I don't really know. Like, I've never seen something like that before. But then again, this was a long time ago and like live streaming, like that, I live stream. Like, I do that, but, like, I have a platform. Like, I I have simple reactions. I I have people who are viewing me, and, and we do stuff and do activities. Like, well, I don't understand why she does it. Anyways, I don't, I don't see what she gets from it either. Like, is she getting paid? Is she, is she making money, or is she lonely, or... I guess that's, that is it. She's lonely. Did I just answer that? I didn't, that would make sense, actually. Um, make a lot of sense, actually. That fits. I think I just answered my question. Um, so let's start the season. Nathan's dealing with some stuff and he needs to get help with it. That's some PTSD. Um, definitely PTSD stuff. And borderline, like, guilt for surviving and potentially Cooper not, or, or you know, having that near death experience. Like the video, comment down below, subscribe if you have not already. See y'all next time.